Hey everybody, welcome back to Squirrel Stampede Gaming. This is episode 40. We are building the Llama Village. Well, the Lego Llama Village. This is a recreation of the newest Lego Llama Village set. Today I'm joined with Lazy Kitty 10 k She's wearing a very cute kitty hoodie set. And where is Ben Ultra? Ooh, Ben Ultra is looking very Mandalorian-esque, possibly up there up top. So we've got a chest of what I think are most of the elements for this Lego build. If you have not seen the Lego set, it is over at our Squirrel Stampede main channel. We have just constructed it today, and it's mostly built of white wool, blue wool, yellow, and a few other things. And we're going to try to get close. It won't be perfect, but we'll give it a shot. So I'm going to let Lazy Kitty and Ben Ultra build up this model, and we will watch as they construct. So go for it, guys. Uh, pick a left or right side. Uh, Lazy Kitty, maybe go to the other side, and... Ben Ultra will construct. Oh, go ahead and place on top of the um, stone there, Lazy Kitty. I'll fix that um, with a shovel. I think I have a shovel. I'll be here to supervise. If you have not given us a squirrel eye or a squamant or a squike, please do so. We would love for you to join in at this crazy squirrel stampede gaming channel. We are always having fun and building interesting things. Oh, you guys need gray wool, don't you? Uh, here's some gray wool. I just put some in the chest just in case. My only worry is white wool. If we have enough white wool, we might have to sub in something as we get up closer to the top. So there we go. Ben Ultra is working on the next layer. If you guys need um, some, maybe I can help you out by building a um, temporary uh, dirt staircase would that help you guys no um some scaffolding that might help whoop it'll be interesting how tall this gets i haven't really kind of calculated that yet um i said oh it'll only take a half hour it's going to take two years of building isn't it so we'll find out here so there's kind of a step stone for you a step set and a lazy kitty maybe you could use one too um over here right hopefully we won't be falling to our doom too much did I bring enough dirt? I Yo, I've got a little bit of dirt here. Hopefully this is enough for Lazy Kitty to get up here. So this is a pretty interesting Lego build. One of my favorites uh, in the last little bit here. It has been a very creative set build. Oh, thanks for the extra dirt, Lazy Kitty. Very helpful. I, oh! as I blow out my ankle falling down. If you recall on our last episode, I had died at a ship. I had fallen and uh, gotten inside the cargo hold and got surprised by a drowned. I thought I was dying through drowning, but it was actually a drowned. Um, I'm okay. I was able to get all our stuff back, but I was sadly uh, killed there. It was, it was a shock to the system. But I was able to get all our stuff back, and so now we're back in town, if you just wanted to know the update on that interesting debacle. I also lost one of my maps. I couldn't believe it. I lost one of my maps, so... Wow, you guys are doing really well so far. Let me know if you're short on anything. Uh, I think Lazy Kitty um, says no. She disagrees with uh, Ben Ultra. Ben Ultra, I think you need to switch up your leg piece, maybe. Um, see what Lazy Kitty has done? Um, I think something is different on your builds of the legs. So do a quick check there and see. I think this white leg region needs to be thicker, doesn't it? Or not? Well, we'll figure that out. I'm going to run over and grab some more white wool while they figure this out and discuss amongst themselves. I'm going to grab some more white wool. If you have not seen the completed Squirrel Manor, this is your chance. Here is Squirrel Manor completed for the most part. There's a few little extras I'd like to add in, but for now it is mostly completed finally. Look at there, Squirrel Manor, all in its glory. We walk into our main chamber, we look up, and we step on slime. Yeah, don't step on slime. So most recently I reworked the tail and the tail features a bunch of different rooms. 
Actually, I kind of would like to sculpt the tail a little more. You see kind of an awkward line going up there. It needs a little bit of extra um, TLC, but I have not got there yet. But you can see the giant squirrel tail in the back. It is completed. There's extra rooms in there. It is surely helpful. And I'm going to hop in here and grab a couple pieces of white wool. I'm really worried we're short on white wool for the llama build. So, uh, oh, oh, no, 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 no. Uh, uh, hey, guys, guys, no, guys. Oh, come on. There's always a sheep incident. Guys, over here. Over here. Come here. I didn't realize I pulled out the wool. And then they wanted to start escaping from my pen here. Okay, so I've got three sheeps of white wool. So, ooh, there's a couple more. There's some more. There's some more. A couple white. There we go. So I just was able to acquire seven, seven more pieces of white wool. Um, <laughs> guys, this is crazy. We hope to build the Lego farm build too. Oh, there's seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I just collected like fourteen more pieces of white wool for our llama. Um, we are going to try to also build the Lego farm. Uh, you stay in there, the Lego farm build as well. Um, but that will probably be episode 41, 42, somewhere in there and in the next week or so too. I have to build the actual Lego set too. I have not got to that yet. So that'll be a fun build too. And then we can move our sheep closer in. I would like them somewhere into this main area. So let's run back here. Give Ben Ultra 21 and Lazy Kitty. Uh, the sun is setting, she is saying, so I gotta head over there as fast as I can. And look at them go, they're working hard on this. It's looking so cool. This is looking awesome. Good job, guys. I'm going to uh, drop off some more white wool if you need it, and I think we're going to take a quick nap in between our build here. Oh, I've got a lot of, a lot of um, wool. Which bed was mine again? I can't remember. Uh, obviously not that one. I'm either I'm the gold bed or the orange. Is it orange? That's one of the three. All right, so we took a nap. How are we doing here? I'm going to take a quick five seconds. Oh, wow, I love what you did with the cobblestone reset there, Ben. That's pretty cool, too. Uh, each one is kind of building their own leg. As long as it kind of levels out, I think we're good. If you guys want to have different legs, that's okay. Um, that's a pretty good design there. Oh, that's Lazy Kitty's side. No, wait. Whose side is who? Benultra's on this side. Lazy Kitty's on this side. And this is a much more taller llama than I thought it would be. So, doing good so far, guys. Do you need more more um, dirt to get up there? How you doing? How you doing up there? This is so cool. I should go up here and get a better vantage point. Maybe I should climb this tree right here. I'll climb this tree and get a better vantage point. Um... How do I climb this tree? Oh, I should have used um, these clippings. There we go. Um, this poor tree. This poor tree. Oh, oh my gosh. This poor tree. Snip that flower out of the way. Okay, I've got plenty to make a little stair step up this tree. Oop. Okay. Into my tree house I go. Wow, guys, you're doing awesome. Look at this. Look how tall it is. I can't believe how tall this llama is getting already. Uh, it's getting quite dangerous. I think I'm going to build them a safety rail around a little bit of the outside here because it's getting pretty tall and scary. I don't want them to die too many times. Ooh, I'm getting hungry on my food, food bar here. So let's see here. I need to first eat a piece of bread. And then I need to work some sort of safety scaffolding around this guy. Safety scaffolding. How's that? Is that safer? Is that any safer? It's a pretty blocky build when you look at the legs. Dirt man, <laughs> that is what I am. I am dirt man, and I've ran out of dirt, so I have to use different colors of wool, I think, um, or tree branches. Um, I ran out of I ran out of a good. This is I hope these colors don't mess your build up. 
So we got some lime green. <laughs> I've got some uh, orange. Pay no attention to these really off colors. This is your emergency uh, scaffolding made out of soft wool. You know, just thinking this llama is going to be like super flammable. Kind of worried about that. Uh, ooh, I don't want to use the blue. I could use the red. No, you might need the red. Um, actually, once you build this floor, this deck, you should be a little safer. So we have a possible leg, leg issue here. I'll just use this cobblestone. It, it won't be perfect. Uh, oop. The construction of the llama. Am I going to fall down? Okay. Whew. So glad I'm able to uh, not fall off tall structures nowadays. Okay, so how we doing? How we doing here? Have we, have we agreed where the, the decking of the, of the birch floor goes? I think so. Oh, <laughs> I'm probably in the way. Squirrel Stampede is in the way. They're like, oh, look at that. So he's using some rock posting because we weren't really sure how we were going to do the indents of those legs. That's pretty clever. Um, there's several different ways to go about it. I know you can't make steps out of wool. <laughs> look at this, look at this structure. Diorite, diorite, very smart. Do you need diorite or do you have enough diorite? That's beautiful, look at this. Look at the structure of our llama. Trying to bestly recreate this. Remember, the head is going to face towards uh, Benny's, Ben Ultra's um, giant whatever he's constructing over there. It looks like it's got a little larger since last time. Oh, and Lazy Kitty finished hers. Let me run over there and check out her kitty just a little bit, not all the way over there. You can see her cat on top of this flying squirrel has been completed. Look at that. And she has used ingenious dripstone as the cat's teeth. <laughs> That's perfect. I should have put some dripstone under my teeth. I don't really have teeth. My mouth is kind of weird. But her cat is floating about on a squirrel, so nicely done there. That's that's a great design. So I peer back over here and they have um, decided possibly on a floor. Let's take um, a five minute break and we can um, kind of figure out where we're at. And I, oh, it's looking so great. I'm so proud of you guys. Okay, we took a quick five minute break to kind of get our planning in order and they're just rocking this. They've got the legs going. They've gone with this really nice inset of cobblestone or diorite or something. That looks like cobblestone in there. I was not sure how they were going to reproduce it, but that turned out pretty well. Uh, I removed the wool and just put dirt up there because it was getting kind of, um, distracting the colors are distracting us um, and we've got steps up here I'm not sure how we are normally going to get into this um, that wasn't really ever planned <laughs> out very well uh, so yeah we'll, we'll figure that out in a little bit um, I can't believe how tall this is getting I was worried we are going to be, make it too small but they're doing just right so Ben Ultra Lazy Kitty right now are focusing on getting the blue panel um, made below the deck of the llama. And they're going to try to kind of figure out how to reach out. I think I need to give them some scaffolding uh, up by the head over here because it's going to get really dangerous over here if I don't give them something to fall on. Because we're going to start dying here. We're gonna start dying if I don't have something, some sort of emergency fall. Maybe even going out one more. This is like the first time we've built in a while. Usually we're just like dying in caves. And we have not really been showing the construction of our houses just because they've been so, so technical. We weren't really sure how to do them. So now this is a fun, can we recreate the Lego Llama village house? set build of summer 2022. The funnest part is going to be trying to delete all this dirt later. Probably don't need to go too much farther here. I think this is enough. Okay. 
Looking good, guys. Looking really good. Whoops. Ah, look at there. They're building the floor inside. Oh, this is interesting. They've inset the birch floor. You can, you guys can connect it together, you know. You don't have to leave them separated. They're, they're deep in thought right now. They are so deep in thought. They're like, hmm, if we put this here, if we put this there, it's good. I like it. Did I bring any? Oh, I've got some birch. Can I connect this together, guys? Is that okay if I did that? <laughs> I'm just trying to help you out so you don't die. <laughs> Dying is their thing, she says. <laughs> Pretty good. I mean, there's not going to be that much room inside this. It is a Lego build, so there never really is much room inside. Um, but from a distance, this llama is enormous. I'm going to have to... Um, <laughs> how do I get down? I don't know how to get down. Um... I think I'll live. Uh, that won't hurt me. Yeah, that's just a few few hearts. Look at this construction. Look at the madness on this. I just hope we don't burn it down. That would be awful. Let's get a treehouse view again. Up to my treehouse. What did that sign say? Bengal colored beds. Bengal beds. I like that. Let's go Bengals. And there we go. It's getting. Look at this. Look at it. So cool. I'm going to go bring them up some wool and things. I think that might help them out as I swallow a burp. What? Ever swallow a burp? It feels so uncomfortable. Burp. Okay, so I'm going to bring some items up to them. Um, I'm going to make a chest for them. Do I have enough material for a chest? I do not. Okay, now I'm going to have to cut my tree some more here. This poor tree. <gasps> This poor tree is just getting totaled. First, oh, first I take no. off its hat, and then I build a stair step up to it, and now I'm stealing its trunk. I don't even know how it's standing, but it's trying to stand. And let's see here. Of course my pockets are full of way too much stuff. Let's see here. Let's get rid of some of this wool. I don't need this flower. Why do I have why do I have some of these things that I have in my in my Oh, almost fell in a hole there. Okay, so let's build them some oak wood planks and let's build them a chest and then I'm going to oops I keep thinking this block right there is a chest and it's not um, I'm going to bring up some wool for them I'm going to bring up a cake for them I'm going to bring up um, this and that and the other okay so and then I'm going to collect some of this that fell down all right Okay. This would have take took me about oh, I want to get that wool, but it's stuck right there. Um, this would have took like 50 years for me to build by myself. And we're doing this in one video. Or half of one video. Episode 40, guys. Episode 40. What are we doing in episode 50? We have to start actually planning that out. Okay, coming up closer. Alright, looking good guys. Where do you want me to put this chest? got a chest for you um, just right here and I've got a cake for you are you guys hungry I'll put a cake down here is a cake if you're hungry there's a cake there's some more white wool in the chest there's some blue wool a little bit of light gray isn't the furnace in the build like right here I don't know I hope I didn't put that in the wrong spot um, Light blue wool, I don't know if they need, they need that. The crafting table was on this side, I'm already forgetting where it was. I'll just put it here. And it doesn't have to be perfect there, so that's looking good. I don't know why I brought this, but I brought that. Okay, so it, it got night. We were, we were trying to plan something. Ah, I've got to get some torches for these guys up here. It's really sketchy. I need to get these beds up to the top. Oh, someone already... Did one of you guys already get your bed? I don't know. We'll find out. We gotta go to sleep here. We were talking too much. Why is this block right there? What happened there? Ah! What? Where did you come from? Where did you come from? We're working on a build here, guy. Alright. 
Ah! Okay. Oh, maybe that was placed there so that the zombie wouldn't come up. Okay, that's brilliant. That's actually really brilliant. Um, alright guys. I've got one torch. I have one torch. I knew there would be one thing that I forgot to bring. Um, how do I get up here? Okay, so... Um, beds. Beds. There's an orange bed. And... Oh, there's some beds in the chest, too. There were a couple other beds, so we, we've got plenty of beds. But, alright, does everyone have a bed? Everyone good? Let's go to sleep before the zombies get us. Because they are very interesting. Oh, there's monsters nearby. I can't sleep because there's a monster nearby. Come on. Oh, there we go. I got it. I got it. We're good. Whew. Those pesky zombies there are not helpful when you're trying to build something. Okay, you guys keep working. I'm going to get a bunch of torches so that we're protected up here. How do I get down? Uh, I'm going to hurt myself again, aren't I? I need food. I need food and I need... Oh, oh, why did I jump? Why did I jump? That was stupid. Ah, creeper! Creeper! There's a creeper down here. Don't you dare blow up our new house. Don't you dare touch our llama house. Ah, it's more interested than they are. Okay. Eee. I'll get you with my enchanted sword of sharpness. Okay. Man. How many, how many things do we have going on at the same time? I gotta run back and grab some torches. I forgot torches. Coal, basic coal. Let me run back. Hopefully they will have something built by the time I get back. Looking good guys, looking really good. Constructing away. We still have a full cake just in case we're hungry. I'm going to kind of get into a good camera shot of them building. Ow! Maybe up here on my tree. And we'll see what they do here. Maybe over on a different tree. I think this tree... Let's get over onto this tree. Yeah, this tree will do it. Oh no, it's raining? No! No! Not a good time for it to rain. But it's looking so good. Okay, this is looking really good so far. How did I get up here? I'm going to help them out real quick by building the top back of the llama. That way there's less chance of falling down. So let's see, is there any white wool left? Oh good, plenty of white wool. I was really worried about our white wool situation. How do we get up here? Oh, you can put a ladder on wool. Did you guys know that? I didn't know that. I think they might just need more dirt scaffolding. You guys need more dirt scaffolding? Should we go to bed real quick? Let this rain stop? Yeah, let's go to bed real quick. Okay, we just got up from another nap and the rain has stopped. I'm going to run back and get some oak and some spruce for our front face of our llama. And I'm going to fall on my knees for the 10th time. <laughs> right there, breaking my ankles. So I'm going to run back and get some extra materials. Wow. This is so much larger than I thought it would ever be. What we might have to do is do a part two and check back in right now. I'm going to give them some extra pieces. And what we will do is come back in episode 41 and finish off. That way we can kind of detail this thing up. We still have the sides and the banners to work on too. I had no idea this would be so complicated. It is so beautifully big. I thought maybe it would be smaller but it is certainly large. Okay, who needs the uh, birch and who needs the what? Or the uh, the spruce? Well, you guys are way... <laughs> I thought I just built this. How did you guys get up there so fast? Oh my goodness, this thing is tall. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna go around. Oh, I can't go that way. 
Yeah, so you can see the complexities of this build. It is absolutely awesome. Oh, you guys are way up there. Um, do I need to build another dirt, um, dirt scaffolding, I guess. Dirt scaffolding number 10 coming up. Who needs spruce? He needs what? Do you have the wood? I do. You want spruce? See if I can get it to you. <laughs> hang on, hang on. Oh. Let me a little closer. Oh, it's still there. Yeah. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> How many pieces did I miss? How high are we? We're like up at the Ben Ultra's base height. <laughs> Lazy Kitty is clapping. Whoa, this lava got big. My goodness, guys. Okay, so we're just, we're, we gotta take a break. So this is episode 40. We're gonna come back at episode 42 and we are gonna finish off this llama because it is just way too tall. So thank you guys so much for watching today. Thank you Lazy Kitty 10 k and Ben Ultra for working so hard so much on this. We have a lot to build and I think we'll have some more time. So we will see you guys next time. Episode 41, look how I'm, look how, oh my goodness, I'm like right, <laughs> that, that's very odd, I'm like floating, I'm like floating to my doom there, so we'll see you guys next time, thank you so much for watching, that's what I have to say about that. <laughs>